Today, this video is about bonding your rabbits. You can, you can get one rabbit and you won't need to bond them, but they always say rabbits will get lonely, so you need, at least, you need two rabbits really, and it's good for them. So basically to bond them, you should wait at least eight weeks after they've been neutered and get them bond, get them neutered as soon as the vet says or as soon as your vet says it's safe to neuter them, neuter them, get them uh, wait eight weeks until all their testosterone's out of them. Not until you get them neutered. Um, we I'll, I'll put up a I'll put up a, um, a picture somewhere here or there of what the run used to look like before before they were actually like this now because obviously they're happy like this they're in a nicer space they're sharing it less cleaning out so we had one the cage like that and we had a cage so big and then we had another cage on top and that had a mezzanine we had made it into like a little mezzanine as you'll probably see on the pictures um and basically what we did was every day I'd have to clean both cages out, top and bottom. Whichever one was in the run at the time, whichever was on at the bottom, they were there all night. We let put let that let that one out there, wherever, and then we cleaned the bottom out. Then got the top one, the top rabbit that was in the double decker one at the top with the mezzanine, and put them in the run. So that was theirs for, for 24 hours or whatever. And then we clean the top run, the top the top cage, and put the one that was out in the top cage. But we used to have to use this 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 casing so they could see each other, clean each other while they weren't bonded. So they could still see each other and they're not gonna try and attack each other because they've got the cage between them. So that was the first step, step what we had to do before we bonded them. They were much happier with it together. So we got them bond, we got them neutered. As early as possible like you should after eight weeks um, you can send them to a bonder but then when they come back they're going to have to fight again because it's a new new territory for them so then you just let them do it um, and they'll circle each other like i'll show you the video somewhere they'll circle each other to try and, and to basically try to hump each other trying to determine who's the boss who isn't and then um, once they've got it out of the system, you'll find a lot, of, uh, quite a lot of fur everywhere because they've been fighting overnight. But once they're neutered, they won't kill each other, and you've got to leave them to it. They shouldn't if they get too erratic, then you to give the prior part and they'll put put them back together. But that's what you've got to do. They've got to find, establish who is the don, who is not. And they, that one even still tries to tries to hump when he when he when he gets a chance to. And we just we just say his name and he stops and this one just runs away because believe it or not that one is the is the don and that one isn't but they are happy together look to see they're happy together make sure you you um you uh you bond them after eight weeks after they've been neutered um otherwise one may die or be, and be killed because they've fought too hard that's the uh bonding process just have to bear with it and eventually they'll be fine. Look at them now, all nice and cuddled up together. So you just gotta do these things. So, uh, hope that was okay for you. Please uh, like this video if you enjoyed it and it was helpful, please subscribe. And the next video about going on holiday, what is best for them and what makes things cheaper for you guys.